Hi Scorpio, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to your reading. So let's keep in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate for everyone. Okay, for Scorpio, please. What message for the spirit for Scorpio's love situation? So at the bottom of the deck we have the ten of wands so someone's not doing well here maybe there was an ending of this connection someone could feel the press drain emotionally some might be having a hard time if there is distance between you two right now so a lot of burns a lot of stress and a lot of anxiety here someone's at the end of this they just want to release it Let's see for the present situation, the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So someone could have matured, some could have leveled up. Someone might now be more financially stable here, wants to be a good provider, wants to, to provide for you, wants to give you stability, maybe they were not able to do that in the past someone could have worked on their finances why is the king of pentacles here why is the king of pentacles here the tower so things could have ended with this king of pentacles here and now someone's having a hard time ten of wands why is the tower here why is the tower here the seven of wands so so after this tower Someone could have pushed you away. You could have pushed someone away. But after this tower moment, after this ending, some might want to fight for this, still fight for this connection. Feel like there's unfinished business here. But someone could be guarded. Someone might not feel the same way. Someone could have been tired. Someone could be tired and hurt here. Let's see for the blocker potential. The five of wands. So conflicts there could be conflicts here between you two there could be an interference people who you know interfere with this connection people people who talked about this connection maybe they were against this connection and this you know your person could have been influenced by that could have been also inner conflict here let's see for the five of wands is the five of wands here the four of wands so there's a lot of potential here. There could have been competition as well. So, you know, there could have been another person. A third party here. So they juggled you and someone else. So there was potential for long-term stability. There was potential for, for marriage here. Are you two were married? Why is the four of wands here? Why is the four of wands here? the knight of wands well someone was a player here yeah someone could have pushed you away because they were a player wanting to play around fool around so competition someone could have not been a real king of pentacles in the past very unstable very irresponsible very mature someone who's not reliable in the past so with that tower that could have been a shift a change here of perspective Let's see for the recent past, for the recent past, and the moon, so Cancer, Pisces, energy, so secrets, could have lied to you, kept secrets, you know, things, you know, being done behind your back with the nine of wands. Why is the moon here? Why is the moon here? The six of cups. So you're dealing with a soulmate, so there was happiness at some point. You felt that it was a good connection before it went south, before possibly someone, you know, really could have shown you who they really were, you know, this player energy. So things could have been going well before that. You were happy, you know. Why is the Six of Cups here? Why is the Six of Cups here? 
the Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So someone was already, you know, was ready for this connection. Someone was grounded, someone was stable. So two different people here, two very different people. So we have a king, a queen of pentacles, and we have a knight of wands. And this could be male or female, okay? Just don't look at the gender. So soulmate, felt that this person was your soulmate. Had a very strong bond, but two very different people. Not on the same page, possibly in terms of values, of beliefs, okay? So one person was very giving, was very stable, was very grounded, was provide a lot of security to the other person, and the other person just provide a lot of insecurity, the opposite here. So I don't think this Queen of Pentacles felt very secure in this connection with all these secrets, right? Competition, conflicts. So, you know, with that tower, it's like possibly a lot of damage has been done, right? And you can't just, you know, go back to where you left off if this is what someone wants here. Let's see for the focus, the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, someone's definitely, fo this King of Pentacles is working on their, their stability here. And with the Nine of Pentacles means detaching from this, from the Five of Wands. From what's blocking what's blocking this connection yeah they're trying to be free of codependencies you know just being very like confident not listening to others opinions right not being influenced by other people they're really trying to be at this place where they're they're going to be very confident and stable financially to be able to provide why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? The Ace of Cups. Because they want a brand new beginning with you. They still have a lot of love for you. They see you as your soulmate. As their soulmate, sorry. Could go vice versa. You could see them as your soulmate as well. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Why is the Ace of Cups here? the nine of swords someone has a lot of regret so yeah they could have pushed you away um pushed you away in the past you know because they listened to other people there was an interference there was competition right there was third party and now they regret doing that and they want to recover this love they want to recover this connection here that's what i feel so they're focusing on this this regret and trying to, to, to be at a stable place here. Let's see for the, because they still want to fight for this. With that seven of wands, yeah. So you could have re rejected your love offer, okay, in the past as well. Rejected your love and, and the stability that you were providing for them. Let's see for the near future, for the near future. That chariot, yeah, they're... They want to move towards you here. They want to take control of a situation. You were out of control here with the Nine of Wands. Knight of Wands. But have Cancer here. Just going in the right direction now. Why is a Chariot here? Why is a Chariot here? The Hangman. Okay. So maybe after a period of stagnation. Could have been stagnating before moving why is the hangman here why is the hangman here because two different energies the four of pentacles yeah someone wants to there was stagnation there was stagnation maybe they were postponing this you know movement here but uh there was stagnation holding back still holding on to this right to this four of wands this connection to you but holding back someone wants to end that with a chariot here so uh, there could have been a, a period of stagnation between you two, of no communication. Someone just is tired of that. So it's at the Ten of Wands. They're tired here, and they want to move towards you. Let's see for the, um, what you should know, the Fool. Yes, they want to take that leap of faith with a chariot and the Fool. This is movement here. Could be with an Aries. Why is the Fool here? Towards their happiness. Why is the Fool here? the four of cups away from yeah they were stagnating with these options here with the four of cups being very unhappy here 
very unhappy, bored. Yeah, see, they rejected the, the Ace of Cups here. They rejected your love. They focused on, you know, other things here, other people's opinions, interference. You know, it's going to be different for all of you. It could be addictions, codependencies, anything, right? And so they want to take that leap of faith away from that. So they were stagnating with that, with the hangman, with that four of cups. Just being so unhappy, still focusing on, on this connection. Why is the four of cups here? Why is the four of cups here? The wheel of fortune, change, all about change. So yeah, so this, this stagnation is, is going to eventually end. Someone's putting an end to that. They're, they're, they're taking that leap of faith away from this Four of Cups. They don't want to be in this energy anymore. You know, they know that, you know, even if there were another connections, they cannot find anybody like you, like the Queen of Pentacles. You were the only one for them. And they just want to get out of this and move towards you. Let's see for the outcome. But this could go vice versa, okay? This could be you as well. Let's see for the outcome. The Nine of Wands, yes. Chaser energy. You could be guarded, again, like the Seven of Wands. Someone could be guarded here. But, uh, yeah, you may not trust them as well, right? You, may, you might be tired. You might be hurt. You don't trust them. But they, they want to they wanna fight for this. Why is the Nine of Wands here? Why is the Nine of Wands here? The Two of Swords. Yeah, I think you, you're guarded here. You're guarded here, but it could also talk about, you know, the stagnation of this connection because it's right above the hangman. So it could just be that, you know, there was a lot of stagnation before they take action. Why is the two of swords here? Why is the two of swords here? The death card. Yeah, they want to end the cycle of stagnation and they want a new beginning here. So Scorpio, this is you. This is your card. Could be you as well who wants this, okay? But... Your person here definitely wants to end this stagnation. They want to fight for this. Nine of Wands is, is chase their energy. They might want to break down your walls here. End stagnation. Move away from all these options here. These Five of Wands, Four of Cups. This interference. And at the right time with the Wheel of Fortune, get on that chariot and, and come towards you for a new beginning. Death card. So... It's up to you, Scorpio, if you want this as well, okay? You have free will. So I hope it resonated with you. I hope you enjoyed the reading. Take care. Bye.